What's up folks, it's your buddy Fatal Roadie. Tonight on Roadie Snacks we'll be trying out a bunch of Pringles flavors. This was supposed to be a two-parter, but unfortunately I had a hard drive crash and I've lost part one. So I'm going to try to put them all together in one show. Hopefully if I find the first one, I'll get that uploaded. Unfortunately one of the flavors, Flame Grilled Steak, was part of that and I no longer have those chips. But those were, I think those were a three out of five. Those were pretty good. But tonight we have roast chicken flavored. That's what that one looks like. Hot and spicy. Extra hot chili and lime. That's what those ones look like. If I can get them lined up. There we go. Chili con queso. That's what those ones. And last but not least, top ramen chicken. That's what those ones look like. But we're going to go ahead and start off with the top ramen chicken. They're kind of like the oodles of noodles flavored. You all know what Pringles look like. They're not bad. You can definitely taste the oodles of noodles flavored. I know they're called Top Ramen, but I've always grown up calling it oodles of noodles. But they're pretty good. I mean, I really wouldn't go out of my way to go get them. I'd say they're about a two and a half out of five. Maybe pushing a three. But I'd, I would just be safe and say two, two and a half. They're okay. It's definitely a different flavor. I will say that much. So the next thing we're going to try is the roast chicken. These ones are kind of tiny chips. They're smaller than the normal ones. It's definitely a different flavor. Uh, something I'm not really exactly used to. I think these ones came from the UK. But I'm not exactly sure. Some of these were sent by my subscribers. And like I said, I think these ones came from the UK. They're decent. Um, I would probably say they're two and a half out of five as well. You can definitely taste the chicken flavor to them, which is pretty good. Like I said, it's different, but I really wouldn't go out of my way to get another can. Next, we're going to try the extra hot chili and lime. I'm going to be honest. I'm usually not too crazy about things that have lime in it because most of the hot stuff with lime in it are usually overpowering with lime. But like in the Duke sausage video, the chorizo and lime one, I was actually surprised. The lime one wasn't really all that prevalent. Good. I can smell lime. These ones are definitely covered in some red. I really don't know what they're calling extra hot. They're really not hot at all, if you ask me. I've had plenty of chips that were hotter than this, and this definitely is not that. The lime flavor is there. It's not overpowering, but like I said, I'm not a huge fan of lime, especially in my hot food. I would give those a 2 out of 5, mainly for the fact that, one, they're not really all that hot, and the lime flavor kind of killed it for me. But if you're into lime and heat, all for you. Next, we'll be trying the hot and spicy Pringles. Again, that's what those ones look like. These ones were sent by a subscriber as well. It doesn't say anything about lime on them, so hopefully we'll be spared that one. These ones are small chips too. They're also kind of crunched up, but oh well. Small chips. I honestly don't know what to think about these. They're definitely not hot. I think these came from Japan. I'm not exactly sure. But I'm all for giving things a second chance. Mm-mm. They're not hot at all. I mean, there's a little bit of a tingle on my tongue. But as far as heat goes, those extra hot ones were hotter than that. And I've actually had barbecue chips that were hotter than this. These ones are not great at all. I would, I would say one out of five. I would definitely skip them. If you're looking for hot chips, there are plenty other fish in the sea besides that one. That, I wouldn't even waste my time looking at it. And last but not least, we have the chili con queso Pringles. 
Um, hopefully these are going to be a little bit better. Certainly can't be as worse as the hot and spicy ones. We are back to full size Pringles though. <laughs> wow, in a strange turn of events, the chili con queso ones are like twice as hot as the hot and spicy ones. Um, they're good. I like them. They got a good bit of heat to them. It's not severely overpowering. And it got a good flavor to them. I would definitely give these a three and a half. Maybe I'd even go as far as saying a four out of five. They're decent. I would definitely get another can of these if I had a chance to. These were sent to me by another subscriber as well. But these are good. Out of all of them, this is also taken into account the flame grilled steak one, which unfortunately I don't have video for. Hopefully I can find that video again. This would definitely be my favorite out of all of them. These would also rank up there with the jalapeno ones, which are actually pretty good as well. But that'll do it for this episode of Roadie Snacks. Leave a comment down below if you've had any of these, what you thought about them, or what you thought of this video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to share and subscribe. I've been Fatal Roadie. You've been awesome. Thank you very much for watching. And remember, if it's too hot, you're too old. Say it.